Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for June 6th of 2023. Well, it is titled Star Eats Planet. So what do we see here? Well, this is actually a star much like our own sun, and it is known by its designation ZTF SLRN 2020. And this occurred in 2020. Now we're looking at an animation showing what was there. Because of the distance, we cannot see this kind of thing directly. This is 12,000 light years away from the sun. So if we think about that, even though we saw it in 2020, it actually occurred 12,000 years before that. And it just took the light from this that long to get here to Earth for us to be able to see it today. Now, as stars evolve, the planets will eventually be consumed by them. And that's what's kind of shown here is the planet will eventually spiral into the star. Now let's watch the simulation while we discuss it a little bit. And as you play the simulation, you'll see that there is an object spiraling in very, very close to the star. And we're seeing its atmosphere being stripped away as it gets really close to the star. Some of it embedded into the star itself, other materials then spread out into space. And as we get closer and closer towards the end of it, we watch as it consumes the star and actually increases in brightness a little bit as it, con it consumes that star. Uh, sorry, that planet. So this is what happens to at the end of the life of a star as it be can begin to consume its planets. Now it will depend exactly on the orbits of the planets. For example, in our solar system, most of the outer planets are quite safe as the sun will never get large enough and they are too far away to ever be consumed like this. However, this could happen to the inner planets as the sun eventually evolves to become a red giant and then a red supergiant, where it will be able to consume those planets and they will eventually become a part of the star itself. Now, how long will that take? Well, we're looking at many billions of years. The sun still has many billions of years of fuel left. And even after that happens, it will take a while before the sun becomes large enough that planets like Earth will eventually be absorbed. Now, this is looking at a larger Jupiter-like planet, so it's much more uh, spectacular than we would expect with just a smaller object like Earth. So you could see this with Earth, but it would be on a much smaller scale. And this is the first time we had ever directly seen a star consuming one of its planets at the end of its life. So something that will happen and does happen all the time in the universe as stars will go through their lives. But this was the first time in 2020 that we were actually able to see this. And today we get to see an animation demonstrating what that might have looked like. So that was our picture of the day for June 6th of 2023. It was titled Star Eats Planet. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.